Good evening. This is Matt here from the House of Sin. It is a negative 16 degrees outside right now. As everybody knows here in Wisconsin, it's been extremely cold and will be the coldest tonight. So, I have gotten some um, oils and I have put them outside. And I'm going to do a cold pour test in the morning. So, as we can see here, on the hood of my Volkswagen, this is a little difficult here. We have three oils. We have O'Reilly uh, Full Synthetic 530, Mobile One Full Synthetic 530, as well as the Amsoil 5W30 Signature Series. Boy, it's cold out here. So, these are going to sit tonight outside and I'm going to do a very non-scientific test to see how they pour out of the bottle. Um, Amsoil did a video uh, this morning up in Superior and some haters were calling it out as not being legit so I'm going to do everything I can to kind of show that it's a legit video. Um, the pour point on the Amsoil Signature Series 5W30 is into the negative 50s. So that should not be a problem. I think it was negative 56 or so is the pour point on that. Uh, the mobile one is like a negative 40 something. And what I found on the O'Reilly one on the data sheet on the website was actually negative 20. So I don't think that's accurate because then it would not even pour out of the bottle uh, tomorrow morning. So I'm going to have them sit out here all night. I do have a little laser temperature deal so I can kind of show you that they are cold and they have been sitting outside i didn't just bring the amazon one out of the um garage here so check back in the morning and i will have that um going for you so see how it turns out have a good night stay warm morning facebook land um just gonna conclude our cold pour video here so um as promised everything set outside overnight and actually i was trying to take readings off of the bottles but it's too low for this to, to read at. So they are very cold. If nothing's warm, because if I went to something warm inside, it would show the show the temperature. So the air temperature is a negative 25 degrees out this morning. So what I'm gonna do is pour these bottles into um, these marked containers. And then um, I'm gonna time how long it takes them to get to 20 ounces, because I wanna pour the whole thing out and draw this on forever. So I'm going to try and pour the bottles in a similar fashion. And uh, we'll start with the O'Reilly 530. I'm going to time approximately how long it takes to get to the the 20 ounce mark. Alright, so we are starting. Uh, can't really. Okay, I'm back. That's what it said, so hopefully this works. Alright, we're having some technical difficulties with the cold and the camera, I believe. Alright, so to get to 20 ounces, it took 52, 52.4 seconds on that one. Now right, we're going to roll to the mobile one. It's freaking and cold out. We're going to start. Yeah, I'm trying to hold them all at similar angles to be as fair as possible to everybody. This is not scientific, I assure you. Can you pour faster? It's really cold out I'm here. I'm trying. And 20 ounces at 52 seconds, 52.1 seconds. Now the Amsoil Signature Series 530.
reset, start, and I kind of give myself a, oh, look how fast that's for it. Look God. at that. And I gave myself probably a full half second to a second uh, disadvantage there. I started the timer before I started pouring the bottle. And we're going to get to the 20 ounce mark at about 30 seconds. So as you can see there, 30 seconds. Uh, not really. There you go. And Amso far and away exceeds the other comp competition here, even including the Mobile One. So again, not scientific, but as scientific as I can get when it's 25, negative 25 out. So hit me up if you had some cold starting issues this winter. Um, this week, I guess, and uh, we can keep all your vehicles starting nice and easy. Morning. Thanks for watching. This is Matt from House of Sin. Have a good day.